Here we are at Snap AV in the Arachnus networking section. Uh, first thing we're going to look at is their set of new routers that are coming out mid next year. Um, the 110 series is the basic single LAN, two LAN port, uh, nice little baby router. It is gigabit throughput, so it's a nice replacement, quick and easy, basic system. Uh, their next step up, it, it is gigabit throughput. It is, not, it is not correct. It is not VLAN. It's just a single WAN input. It doesn't have dual WAN input. Uh, the 310 is the replacement for the one that we've been using for quite some time with gigabit throughput, which is huge for us. This actually has three WANs, two standard WANs, and actually has a direct fiber input. Direct fiber input. Wow. So this is the replacement for the one we've been using for quite some time now. There is a new 510 series that has four WAN inputs. In addition to that, three of the LAN jacks on here are direct PoE. So if you've got a system, you can plug your access points directly into this router and need nothing else there. Uh, you can also use these USB inputs for a USB to SIM card dongle for cellular backup. Uh, the majority of the larger switches are staying the same. Their new option is the compact switches. What's great about these is these are actually powered over PoE. So if you have a PoE switch in the rack and you need a small extension port, you plug the PoE main switch into one of these and it actually powers the device and passes through PoE power. So you can plug this in behind a TV and a gateway and an access point. It's powered over TV and it powers the gateway and the access point for you without any external power and oh, taking wow. up your outlets. Nice. And they have those up to a 16 port. Wow, okay, cool. Amazing. Okay, so what about access points? Are we seeing any change here? Uh, the change, uh, they've actually started shipping it. There's the 700 Outdoor series. The it's, the, it's the big boy right there. Okay. Um, so it, it's the same technology as the 700 series that we've been installing. It's just in an outdoor encl enclosure. Okay. Huh. And then, all right, so do all of the switches and routers mount? Are they able to be mounted in boxes? Yes, they are in a snake oil can. They'll work in a snake oil can. This is the, uh, the compact switch. It's actually powered over PoE, as you can see here. There's no external power supply on this unit. And then they've got their, <laughs> their oversee hub at the bottom, and they actually have a watt box built into the bottom of the can. Yeah. Wow, okay. Good. All right. Well, pretty exciting. That's what's going on. That's what's going on at Snap.